20, 10. Hey, 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 welcome back to Sim Aviator, everyone. Happy Monday. Such a pleasure to see you all. Beautiful day, beautiful city of Beirut that we're gonna leave today. Look at all those skyscrapers. Beautiful scenery we have here. Microsoft Flight Simmer Simulator at its finest. But hello, hello, hello. Welcome everyone. Sean George, welcome. Pause of five. Welcome aboard. C Whitman 2007. Hello, hello, welcome. Southwest 678. Hello, my friend. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We're gonna go back straight to the airport to our plane here. Uh, who do we have? Gemini Jets 777. <laughs> Hello, welcome, welcome, welcome. Elon Musk, welcome to the stream. Pleasure to have you. Ernol says, Wiley Barrett. I don't know, man. We gotta... All good things must come to an end. And on the way, we'll have a much, 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 much more interesting stuff to go into. But welcome, everyone. Look at that beautiful airport down there. I don't even know where we are. Oh, we're right there. There we go. Right to the Iraqi air delivery that we have with our own personal registration November 27 Papa beautiful 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 here we go let's get out of that and let's watch that livery November 27 Papa Iraqi Airways beautiful livery different color uh, we obviously have the flag of Iraq here and we'll be going all the way to Baghdad guys all the way to Baghdad but good day, good day, good day. Doesn't look too bad for weather in Baghdad as well. We are obviously rocking live weather here. So that is going to be what we're going to do. So all in all, all in all, let's jump into the cockpit. Go ahead, turn on the battery one and battery two here. Um, and then uh, obviously you got to turn on the fuel pumps here. Oops. And then let me go ahead and get rid of this music and then we can go ahead and go with our usual music. Ah, uh, give me a second. I missed it. Where it is? Okay. Here we go. Music off. And woo, quiet headphones now. Uh, and let's let's play some other music that we have. Shuffle. There we go. All right. Ah, wish I could join you. Wow, oh, man, you can you can still join. You can still join if you're not flying. But why does my A320 look weird? Well, what? it looks normal to me. Um, if you're talking about the cockpit, then this is the experimental version. So that's probably why you're seeing some different textures here. Beautiful textures, not gonna lie. They have just dramatically changed this entire airplane here, which is great. Anyway. That's probably why you're seeing all these things. A lot of detail put into that. Uh, let's connect external power. Start aligning the IRSs on battery. We got those lights, which makes it so much more realistic. Yeah, yeah, it is. It is the experimental, so that's why it looks different. But this is this is more realistic. I have to say that they've done a great, great, great job. Not gonna lie. All right, IR three coming in, and got the yeah man. I'm in. The stable version didn't work fine. Um, the what's it called? The dev version did not work fine. So this is this is the experimental version that we're gonna go ahead and give it a try, buddy. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Uh, let's check what we have on the overhead. Emergency exit lights armed. Strobe lights gotta come back to auto. We don't want that on. Wait, what? Uh, landing lights. Um, I think those are in off position, are they? Uh, no, 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 they're, they're in on position, hold on, I have some switch key binding, yeah, there we go, that looks good, nav light to one, oops, I think it was at one, is it, no, there's only one, one position there, so that is looking good, yeah, it could be, it could be, who knows, who knows, it could be the problem, it could be the real problem, all right, let's go ahead and do that, the usual cold and dark startup sequence here. Oops, where are you going? Uh, full brightness on that one and that one. And then obviously we're going to turn off the brightnesses on these displays right here. So that's looking good. Either way, Simjet Virtual has an A330 hopping around. 
Southern Asia, wonderful, wonderful. We're expanding. We're definitely expanding, that is for sure. Uh, what do we have? Ecamps, let's bring those up. Ecamps coming on. And we're looking good, we're looking good. Very solid here. Let me just increase that brightness a little bit. And let's jump into this one. I gotta figure out how do I get the sim brief. I think it's somewhere here. Yeah, I think it's here. In it. And then let's hit the request on init data. And we have it. We have the flight, which is wonderful. Um, we have that. Let's go back. And then let's go to the actual init one. And then we can hit init request here. There we go. That is good. Uplink insert. Um, now I, I do have I do have one question for you, Arnav. If you have done this before, um, does does the fuel get automatically loaded, or do we have to do manually? I think I think we got to do it manually. So what we're gonna do is go back to the menu, Atsu, AOC menu. And yeah, that's what we have. And then. I think that's that's the fuel we need nine point or is that the current fuel uh, that's I think that's the current fuel um, how do I how do I get the get the fuel amount is is that is that why we need max bloom hello welcome 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 um, I'll, I'll 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 just check it out I'll just check it out on the flight plan real quick nothing to worry about yeah the flight plan does say six point three tons so that's what we're gonna take here. Uh, let's bring that. There, there was a way to see it, but we'll, we'll figure that out later. Hello, Max Bloom. Hope you had a great Monday so far. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, my friend. Uh, um, let's see. 6.3 on here. So we need to take slightly less fuel. No, not that less. Uh, yeah, that, that looks good. And then for payload, uh, all we have is so we don't have to bring up the flight plan anyway, so that should be good. Um, Simbrief gives it, yeah, yeah, Simbrief definitely gives us payload is 16 tons. How much do we have here? All right, uh, let's take more. Yeah, that should be good enough. All right, um, yeah, that's that's much better. Let's go to in it, go back in it B here. Uh, obviously get that information here oh I think I think that's where it comes uh, I think that's where it comes but block fuel is uh, 6.3 so we'll take that and then put in here that looks good let's go to the flight plan page Oba uh, I mean we obviously have the departure information right there uh, what I'm gonna need is the METAR right here so that I believe is uh, here, no, 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 not that, not that. Atsu, it's it's that one's in Atsu as well. So AOC menu, we gotta do weather request, and that should be good for now. Hey, 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 hey! Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Thirteen likes already, guys. Thank you so so much for that. Really, really, really appreciate your support. All right, we're gonna go back, um, go to received messages, and wait for that message to arrive. I think, I think we do have it. So let's hit that again. There we go. Metar is here. Let's print it. Hey, Captain Flight Wings, welcome, welcome, welcome. Good day to you, my friend. Good day. Welcome to the stream, buddy. Captain Flight Wings, pleasure to see you on board. Welcome. All right, is it printing? Yeah, it's already printed. So we have that, and then we can go back to the flight plan page so we do have winds that are 130 at um, 2 knots and so we're gonna take runway uh, which one was the one we landed on I think it was 16 that's that's the one besides us so we're gonna take 16 and let's insert that that looks good and Orby we're gonna come in 120 at 9 we'll have to see yeah okay Okay, one one five left is three. That's four thousand meters. That should be more than enough. So let's let's do ILS one five left based on the wind conditions here, and insert that. Oh, Marie, my friend. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the stream. Pleasure to see you on board. Welcome, welcome. And well, we're doing Microsoft today. Microsoft around the world. Leg number twelve. 
we're, we still have 68 more to go. <laughs> that's that's a lot of legs. That is for sure. That looks good. Let's go to the perf page. Get the Wii speeds here. And that is looking good. Um, obviously radio. I don't know why it says 000. zero, zero. Let's see what happens here. Oh god, what what is going on there? <laughs> Do you see that? Thank god we're not flying on Oh, there we go. We have it. We have it better now. I was gonna say thank god we're not flying uh, on Watson, but yeah, that is good. Uh, is the TICA wait, what is that? TICA tick A? You, you gotta spell it again. Sorry, if I will, I will get the Bravo. Yeah. Let, let me know what that is. All right, we're gonna do flaps one here and no THS. Uh, Flex temperature. We do usually what we get on uh, tow list because I don't know how to bring that up here. But hey, Chief Sim Pilot, hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. TCA, TCA, yeah, TCA, definitely worth it, man. It's it's if if you have the Logitech or the one that I was using, man, it's a huge upgrade. I'm not gonna lie. Anyone who's used it will tell you. But yeah, obviously, if you're using T1600M. In that case, it's a different thing, but if you're using anything that's like on the cheaper side, TCA will change your life and your landings, that is for sure. Anyway, uh, this looks good. Takeoff runway is set. Uh, let's check what we have here. Um, bring that zoom to 20 here. Um, and obviously, we don't have the Wii now working. Our cruise altitude for today is going to be, uh, let me check real quick, uh, 350. So let's set that here. Uh, maybe I'll use the buttons right here. Yeah, that is easier. 350. Obviously, we're flying with Dot the ATC. So that is good. Um, obviously, on the speed tape, we gotta get. Gotta get Wii 2 plus 15, and then we can go manage speed after that. So, about there. And then heading and everything looks good. Flight directors can come on here. Let's just bring them on both just in case. Oh no, that's LS. That's not flight director. There we go. Sampa, hello, 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 hello. Welcome. Yeah, it is. It is. It is absolutely plastic. Or no, I'm not gonna lie. It is absolutely plastic. But, but the size of the quadrant, man, it's it's gorgeous, man. It's apparently it's it's a one to one match for your actual Airbus. Man. I mean, what what better can you ask, man? Actual one to one match for the size of an actual Airbus handle. So, definitely, man. Definitely. All right. APUs coming on. Let's check the overhead. Uh, make sure cruise supply. We're not missing that cruise supply, or we're gonna die. Um, that is looking good. Um, let's go. Seat belt signs on. No smoking lights can come to rather auto. And we're looking good. Let's go ahead and turn on our beacon light here. And we are ready to go. The quadrant is so small. What quadrant? The TCA quadrant or the Bravo th Bravo quadrant? I'm talking about the side stick here, the TCA side stick. But anyway, let's go ahead and uh, get, uh, get the controls cam here going. Um, here we are, controls cam, TCA. No, TCA quadrant, uh, probably not worth it, man. If you're getting the Bravo, um, then just, just get those Airbus handles. That is going to be much better. Like, definitely. Alright, this is looking good so far. Auto brakes. Ah, let's not set that. And let's check on the outside. APU is coming on. Oh, by the way, this is the first time. This is the first time we're gonna be seeing some some contrails. Hopefully, I, I haven't tested it yet, but with the new update come the new contrails. So that is always, always, always a good thing. Alright, let's get rid of the parking brake here. Um, APU bleed is on. Let's bring that to start and push back. Yeah, the pushback tug is coming in. It, it is the exact size. Come on, man. It, it is the exact size. <laughs> it's it's not chemtrails, bro. It's contrails, my friend. Contrails. Chemtrails is a conspiracy. Contrails is the real thing. Chemtrails are fake. Yeah, uh, contrails are fake. Yeah, we'll, we'll see how it looks like. All right, so we're gonna be turning on our engines and you guys don't wanna miss the startup sounds. So we're gonna go ahead and pause this and we'll go from there. Oh, we're already pushing back. All right, let's go engine number one here. There we 
go. Thumb rotation. Seeing some rotation there. There we go. Engine's coming on. Oh god, I'm gonna I'm gonna come back to it once we have the engine start. Sampa, Sampa, that's that was for you. Here we go. That uh, last Neo Engine sound. Uh, is it there? Alright, that is looking good. That is looking good. It says available. Let's go get engine number two here. And we're gonna end the pushback in just a second once we once we get to that point right there. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Second engine almost coming alive. And that should be more than enough. Let's go quickly set up our parking brake and then we can go out and hear that sound again. There we go! Engines are coming alive. We're in the game! Boys, we are down. We are down. Yeah, I have checked out the A330 for MFS Gemini, definitely. I just just been too lazy not to install it. But anyway, let's bring this back. Um, normal. Uh, let's check. Speed brakes can be armed. Let's go flaps. One. And there we go. Flaps coming out. That's that's real fast. I, I don't know if that is that is so fast in the real world but anyway since our engines are on we can go ahead and get rid of APU bleed APU can come off as well um, let's do tech nose light to taxi runway turn off lights can come on and yeah this is good this is good wing lights can come on as well just for the sake of it um, let's check the temperature what is the temperature outside because we're gonna be going through some clouds um, which is temperature 15 so so not too bad we'll, we'll see we'll see how it goes now back to the Navigraph charts and uh, I'm gonna bring up the taxi chart for myself don't want to go to the wrong runway here uh, give me a second taxi 10 9 all right this is good. oh we're gonna take off from runway 16 apparently but there's no way to taxi to that. What? We're gonna have to backtrack on the runway. Alright, so we're gonna turn right and take November. Anyway, let's bring the chat back on. A33X mod. <laughs> Alright, ready for. Oh, by the way, ultimator. We forgot the ultimator. Ultimator is 1011. Here we go. Um, 1011. One zero one one. All right, ready for taxi. Before that, we're gonna do a quick flight controls test. Rudder right, rudder left, centered, ailerons, elevators, and we're good to go. Good to go. Auto brakes. Gotta set the auto brakes to max here, and we'll just check the cabin takeoff config, and we'll be good to go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's get the parking brake off, and we're gonna get out of here some thrust right there oh by the way I don't know I don't know if you if any of you guys would know this but do we have uh, do we have an option to have a nose wheel tiller on the joystick because the steering by rudder is uh, not particularly realistic so we want to avoid that we're definitely gonna have to backtrack on the runway Unless, unless there is a taxiway on the chart that I'm not looking at. Whichever your plane can handle that. Yep. And 
let's get the turn going in. Hey, what's why? <laughs> wait, 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 we're rudders. Hey, okay, there we go. Oh, why, why are we stopping the turn, bro? What is going on here? Airplane, what are you doing? Oh, we're gonna stay straight on that. Let's give it a little bit more thrust. Uh, make that turn. There we go. Could probably use differential thrust on that one. Here we are, getting out of here. Okay, okay, yeah, uh, we'll we'll check that out in cruise maybe. What will you do for 500 subs? A very special, special, special stream. Although we are still what, 55 away from that. Still a long way to go, so a lot can happen in that much time, buddy. Definitely a lot can happen in that time. Alrighty. Coming in, bring that turn right. Um, let's check out ground speed 21, which is good for this these kind of turns. You don't want to turn make like tight turns at more than 10 knots. That that is one thing, yeah. Don't don't try to Tokyo drift into an airport. That's not how it works. But yeah, we'll, once we hit 500, we'll definitely be doing like a bunch of giveaways. And we'll try to make it as special as we can, man. Definitely. Obviously, we're gonna have a custom livery painted for us. And if you guys don't know, Arno is the one who's painting the livery. Yeah, that's that's supposed to be a huge secret. All right, we're backtracking the runway, so don't don't think we're taking off here. We're basically backtracking when there's no taxiways, as you can see. Uh, let me go on the outside. See, there's there's basically no taxiways onto this runway. There's only a turnout, so that's what we're gonna use. No, we're not using the old joystick as a tiller, right? I could just use this one as a tiller. Nothing wrong with that. Painting. Use them as paint. All right, thrust back to idle because we're gonna have to stop in a moment. We're doing 43 knots on the on the backtracking which is allowed by the way you can if you're backtracking a runway you can do 50 knots for the taxi don't 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 let anyone tell you otherwise all right let's slow this thing down slow this thing down there we go there we go and uh, we're just gonna go out here onto those lights break them maybe who knows all righty there we go. Yeah, more realistic, but then takes up more desk space, you know? You know what I mean? That's that's a bigger problem than... Uh, you know? And I, and I sold it, by the way, so I mean... Not that we can do anything. Anyway, let's go ahead, turn the landing lights on. Strobes can come to on. We are ready for departure. Ladies and gentlemen, flex in the chat here as we take the center line off the runway. Here we go. Engine stable, 40%. Wait, what? All right, we're good. We're good. 100 knots. Checked. We want rotate. Ever so slowly, two to three degrees at a time. Don't want to get a tail strike here. Here we are getting out of here. 15 degrees nose up. Positive rate, gear up. Uh, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep hand flying this. I want to climb as fast as I can uh, because I don't want to crash into the mountains. Here we go. Wait, really? No way. All right, we're making that left turn now. We're clearing the terrain. Let's actually bring the terrain radar in, which is not looking good. Okay, we're we're gonna keep the lever. 
right where we are. Don't want to bring it to a climb, um, climb position yet, although the plane does say Fireball18981. Welcome to the stream, buddy. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Good evening, my friend, or good day wherever you are, buddy. Welcome to the stream. All right, we're looking. Uh, let's let's look on the other side. Yeah, we're looking good. We're looking good to clear that. So let's go do that. And we're gonna go. And we're still maintaining 160 knots, and we're climbing. Keep that left turn coming. Oh, we gotta we gotta capture. We gotta capture that path there. All right, we can bring the dis ascent uh, climb rate down a little bit, ever so slightly, and we can go ahead and go to the climb setting and we can go man at speed here hopefully hopefully it all works out fine okay, bring that nose down a little there we go 14 on the legs 15 incoming maybe many more all right flaps up Looking good, We're coming back onto the LNAF path or the managed heading path. And we're gonna go ahead and do this uh, direct labor. Let's hit that, and we're looking good from here. Uh, let's turn right here and uh, bring that nose down. All right, let's see 35,000 feet. We're gonna wait. Why are you pitching us down? No plane. No, 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 no. I'm not letting that happen. Flight directors, are you drunk? Are you drunk, flight directors? <laughs> hey, XP Aviation, 16 has come. Thank you, thank you, thank you, buddy. Thank you. Really appreciate it. How are you doing, man? Haven't seen you in a while, man. I mean, I've seen you on other streams, but not, not on your streams or my streams. Do, hope you're doing well, buddy. And hope everything's well and good. Fireball says, I got MFS, and I want to know how do I get different airlines and a different airline for the starter plane. Hold on, give me, uh, so you basically, there's only three airliners now, the fourth one is gonna come out tomorrow. Um, three three inbuilt and the fourth one, the CRJ, the Aerosoft CRJ is gonna come out. So you definitely wanna get that. Uh, but let's do, hold on, I, I'm gonna complete that before. Uh, let me do that and let's continue that climb. Hopefully the autopilot doesn't kill us. I'm continuing the climb here. Yeah, so, so yeah so basically yeah the so crj from aerosoft is gonna come tomorrow to microsoft they definitely want to try that out um, all right we're climbing <laughs> we're climbing i don't want to die when i answer you but we're, we're looking good so far let's get you guys some of the view from the forward side beautiful engines we obviously missed the gear up but i wanted to focus there um and then let's uh disarm those let those lights can come back to taxi actually you know what we're just gonna wait just gonna wait to clear 10,000 feet now I gotta focus I'm not I'm not gonna look at the chat for two minutes here because we might need to do a terrain escape maneuver because this is not looking good the plane better continue the climb no you know what I'm gonna take matters into my home, own hands toga power and I'm just I'm just gonna bring us out of here before we die or it kills us it's gonna continue I, I I think that was a good call I think that was definitely a good call we're just just keeping straight on the path here it does say lever to climb but we don't want to mess this up I don't want to crash into a mountain otherwise we'll end up in another mama shark grill you know we, we don't want that to happen do we <laughs> I, I don't know if you guys saw it but yeah, that's basically the last blooper I have Looks like we have cleared the mountain, but I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna fly it manually for now, uh, and then we'll go from there. We can actually pitch up more, crossing 10,000 feet. We're looking good. Let's get rid of the landing lights here, and runway turnoffs can come off as well. So can the wing lights here, and strobes can come back to auto here. All right, there we go. I think I think we're cleared now so let's go ahead and bring the autopilot back in and uh, let's bring the auto throttle back to climb now let's let's just observe what it's doing there we go we're looking good now 
on the other side. Yep, pretty good. All right, now back to the chat. I got MFS and I don't want, uh, yeah, different. So, so, so for airliners, yeah, you gotta use the ba default ones. Um, and tomorrow the Aerosoft CRJ is coming up, probably around 50 bucks is what I heard. So that's how you can get that. And regarding the airline, so you mean deliveries, you can go to this website. Get, let, let me put a link for you. Uh, flightsim.to. Basically, you go to this website and then search for the plane you want. So basically, if you want the A320 Neo, then you, you search for deliveries in that and you will see a bunch of, bunch of, bunch of different airliners. Yeah, you, and you can definitely get Delta in that fireball. Um, hope, hope you can. Um, if, you, if you don't find out, uh, let, hit me up on Discord and I will be more than happy to help you. But with that being said, let's get rid of the controls cam. And we're looking good. Let's bring that zoom level all the way out. We're going, we're going. But yeah, I, I wish I could. I wish I could show you how I, I do it right now. But I, I don't have website uh, browser source enabled yet, so that's why I'm not doing it. So, but otherwise, I would have definitely shown you. Well, let me know which view you guys like the best. Or let's see if there's any mountain. What? What is? What on earth is that? Is that? Is that snow? Or I, I don't know. I don't know what that is. But that that looks very interesting. It's very intriguing. It does look like snow, but it's not a uniform snow. Maybe it's on the top of the mountains. It's something, something, something wrong with the ortho. You know, ortho for not, not obviously the X-plane ortho, but the normal ortho. That is what it is. Arnold says, also I would recommend the 8K liveries Mega Pack, extremely high quality and have pretty much all, including Delta. Yeah, Mega Packs are good, but I, I'm just staying. I'm personally staying away from 8K liveries. Because first, you you cannot really see it on a 2K or 4K monitor or a normal 1080p. Second thing, you know, more you don't want to use more resources than they should. I may be wrong here, but yeah, that is that is what it is. Looking great, says Chief. Thank you, Chief. Thank you. Clouds built into the scenery, maybe. Yeah, that looks like a good option. Uh, I mean, a good possibility. But I don't know. No, I don't think those are clouds. We had those in the last stream we did, but it's it's definitely not not that. Yeah. Here we go. Look at that. That is so so so. What do we have on this side? Oh, unfortunately, we're still climbing. Oh, and by the way, I gotta pay attention to the climb as well. We're 20,000 feet and climbing. Let's bring the constraints up and see if there's any constraints we have to follow. Uh, Arnold says that is thing is that if it's not a delivery can look jagged. Um, this is from what I know, this is not an 8K delivery. Uh, let's see if it looks any bad, any bad, you know. Yeah, if you if you're going like super close, and yeah, I can see those little markers right there. But otherwise, like you know, you're you're, you're not never gonna look at like so close. You know, you're, this is this is probably the max you go close, or maybe that much. And, Honestly, this this looks good. This looks good. And guys, if you haven't already, Nightbot has put a link in the chat. That's our Discord channel. Make sure to join that to stay in touch and up to date with the coming upcoming streams. We have a very very special stream coming up on Thursday, which will be on Explain. So remember, keep an eye out on that. Thursday is going to be a very very special stream, and obviously, 500 subscribers special stream with a ton of giveaways is just around the corner. Make sure you don't miss out and join the Discord, join the family. We also obviously have our very little, very own and little and no hassle virtual airline in the Discord that we have. We are obviously flying on now. Um, I gotta check. I gotta check if it's tracking me. By the way, yeah, I think it should be tracking. Yep, it's looking good. Arnold says, "Also, I'm upset." That delivery for the plane that I'm painting is not an 8K, it's 12K. Wow. <laughs> you're, you're raising the bar there. I guess. You're raising the bar. I'm going to get some smoothie for myself. In a not so good cup. There we go. 260 on the climb. I don't know if it's supposed to do that. Um, do we have it on the init page here? Oh, actually, the cost index is five. I don't know how much sim brief gave us. My bad. My bad. I did not look at that sim brief. Ah, yeah. Anyway, sim brief gave us five. 
So we have to do with the 260 knots on the climb, which is uh, not that not that great. Not gonna lie. 16k, no way, man. I I feel like you're bluffing now. 16k, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> Ooh, like our eyes can't see that that much, you know. Our eyes are not trained to see so much. Oh, look at those some desert sand dunes. Beautiful, man. Can we see it from the window view? Or the wing view, no, actually not on that one and not on that one. So I'll have you guys enjoy it on this view, maybe. Yep, look at that right underneath. Should you tweeze the come? Not yet, not yet. We're still way, 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 way far off from 500, man. Better, better keep your excitement under check, buddy. <laughs> We're way too, way too far away from 500. Unless, unless a miracle happens. Then we'll, 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 we'll do it in due time, but yeah, still 445, 55 more to go for 500. But man, you know what? I, I'm really looking forward to that one, man. And I'm, I'm not gonna lie, like, it's going to be great. It's really going to be great. No, four 4k files. Oh, okay. Well, that makes sense. That makes sense. Absolutely. Engine views are the best, man. I mean, I, I love wing views, but engine views are the best. I, I don't know what you guys think. What what do you guys? What are your guys' favorite views um, in in Microsoft or or just any flight sim? Or actually, in a flight, obviously you cannot have a cockpit view. But but that that is what I'm saying. That is what I'm saying. So let me know in the chat what your favorite views are. It has better view. What what has better view? Yeah, wing views are amazing. But personally, you know, this view, I love this view on the Microsoft. I mean, obviously I said it. Fireball says, is there a way I get to donate? Um, not, not yet, Fireball. Unfortunately, we haven't um, yet um, created that. Um, but we'll, we'll definitely probably have it um, on 500 subscriber special. But yeah, we currently do not accept any donations. But thank you for thinking about it, buddy. Really appreciate it, Fireball. Really, really do. released custom views released custom views tail views yeah I mean I mean there's there's a bunch of views here on the camera if we if we go uh, I I am very bad with this because I haven't used a lot of cameras here uh, maybe showcase fixed camera yeah that's a tail view this is a beautiful wing view right here um, like actually a different kind of wing view. This is this is actually a good view. Not gonna lie, this is a good view for for like landing gear extension and retraction. That is gonna be good. And instead of donating to you, you can support. Yeah, we we can do it. We can do it at some point. Yeah, we're working on that as well. We are definitely working on supporting um, joining the same wing support group. So our our friend Chief is gonna help us do that. So we're just we're just waiting on that. Definitely, definitely, definitely. I, th I think I like this view. So this is pretty cool. Oh, by the way, I almost forgot. Do we do we have contrails yet? Uh, uh, let's see. No, wait. What what happened to contrails? And are we level at? Uh, wait, well, why are we? Hold on, hold on. Why are we descending, buddy? Oh, hey. All right, back to climbing. That's good. God, you can't leave this plane alone for a second. <laughs> uh, Fireball, um, I'll hit me up on Discord. I will, I will, I'll send you the link on how to do that, um, how to do the views. But yeah, this is so. This uh, unfortunately for Microsoft Flight Simulator right now, these are the only two views you can do. But but yeah, you can. Yeah, definitely, man. Uh, I'll hit. Uh, I'll, I'll. I'll send you the link on Discord. Don't. No worries, man. Anytime. Um. And keep the questions coming, man. You don't have to say one question, five questions, man. Just, just as many questions as you want, man. No, no problem about that. No problem. Are right, we turning? Let's go to that view. Wow. Sometimes. What is that? Is is that? Okay, that's a cloud. That's a tiny cloud right there, which is cool. 
<laughs> this is looking great. All right, well, you see all the trash on the other side? Yeah, that's so this is the only two views you can actually do. Wait, what? Really? Is it in the menu? Oh, oh no, we got, we got him. We got him. We got the we got the controls here. Yeah, I I'm not I'm not really sure on how good they look or if they look good. I'm not I'm not really sure on that. What's up with the engines? Textures are looking off. But yeah. Yeah, the contrails are too st too streamlined for my personal taste. Like they they gotta disperse at some point. But that is what it is. There we go. What time is it for me? It's about 6 p.m. 6 p.m. Daylight savings just kicked in when the Pacific daylight time. 6 p.m. here in California, Fireball. Go showcase 14. Let's let's see if we can do that. Showcase 14. Uh, wait. Why why can't I scroll down? Okay, there we go. 14. This is good. This is good. This is pretty decent. 19. Oh, this is this is the usual, but we don't get the windows there. There's some good views here. A bunch of wing views. I think I think I'm gonna keep that for a while, or maybe not. A bit too much. 14 is good. 13 is the one similar to one we were using. 11, 10. Oh wow, that's that's a close engine view there. Anthony Byrne, hello, 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 welcome, welcome to the channel, welcome to the Discord. Thank you so, so much for joining, my friend Anthony. Pleasure to see you, welcome to the SimFam, man. And I'll, I'll definitely, once the stream is over, I'll definitely personally welcome you myself in Discord. Absolutely, hope, and thank you for your good wishes, buddy. Hope you're enjoying the stream so far. We got a lot more to do, and yeah, by the way, guys, for people who weren't here, Thursday is going to be a very, very special stream, so don't forget to hit that bell notification if you are subscribed to the channel. It's it, uh, Trust me, trust me, it's, it's going to be a great one. Alright, what is going on here again? 30, <laughs> we're descending. We got to stop the climb in 35,000 feet. I don't know why we went to 36,000, but we got we to gotta stop that climb. Hopefully it, it behaves here. Alright, that, that, that is looking good and promising, although that sound is okay there we go oh, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna monitor the sound here real quick uh, not the sound but the descent here uh, and make sure everything is good um, because this is not behaving nicely so we're shooting its altitude it should never do that by the way back to QNH um, actually pulled to standard so it's down arrow here 35600 uh, it still wants to climb. I have no clue why it wants to climb. Hey, hey, stop, 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 stop. Let's do it that way. No, bro. What on earth are you up to, bro? What on earth? Okay, that. All right, stop the stop the descent. Stop the descent right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. Let's get come on airplane what are you doing all right we're good no no don't don't are you kidding me this is hilarious why why bro descend jeez no 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 bro 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 no 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 what am I doing wrong? Can someone tell me if I'm doing anything wrong here? We're on climb. We're on the the uh, the annunciators are not saying anything. We're 30. My goodness! <laughs> Come on! Seriously? <laughs> are you kidding me? Singapore to Bangkok is a longer than expected. Than I expected. My stream will be longer. Th oh boy. Good luck with that. All right, we're focusing on the altitude again. I don't like this, man. I don't like this. I absolutely don't like this. And what is... Oh, that's the texture. I was like, what's going on there? 
All right, can we can we stop descending here, bro? Altitude, yeah, I would hope so. Wait, what is that? This one? Ah, oh, wait, that is what it is. All right, let, let's see if that helps. And I, I don't know what this one means, but that might be the problem. All right, let's see. Let's see if we stop ourselves here at 35,000. Stop that sound, please. Please stop that sound. All right, anyway, let's get the music back, man. These, these things are going to drive us crazy. All right, let's hope. Let's hope. Probably that is what it is, but uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see. If, if there's anywhere else I need to change it, let me know as well. All right, stop. Stop. No. God damn. <laughs> yeah, this is driving me crazy. Absolutely nuts. What is going on here, my friend? This, this plane just doesn't want to behave. I don't know, like, my question is why me? Why why are you misbehaving for me? Why are you working fine for everyone else? Maybe maybe there's something, but I, I think this is looking good. Uh, obviously, we're, we're just gonna oscillate, I guess. 350. Let's see. Let's see what we have for the waypoints here. It does say 350. So that is good. Uh, let me check. I'd stop the climb. Wow. You gotta be kidding me. Is there anywhere else I can put the... Uh, this is cruise. Managed 290. That is fine. Is, is there something I'm missing here? Uh, cruise 350 it says so that is that is set as well right there I'm going to Modic we're gonna go direct to Grapple let's see if that helps something something should help we're on open climb where it apparently it says open descent now uh, let's try that one more time can we bring that to open climb let's do this and then 350. All right, open descent. We're coming down. Oh boy. This is madness. Absolute madness. All right, now we're all gonna over speed now. We're gonna over speed here. Why? Don't ask me why. We're gonna over speed here. GG. All right, just on the horizon, just right there. We're gonna. We're gonna hopefully stop the climb at 35,000 feet. I'm bringing it down that descent rate. God. Alright, the speed is coming back. That sound is annoying, to be honest. You know, these guys are probably gonna force me into getting the CRJ. Alright, are we level? Can can we do an altitude hold here? Uh, let's see. Let's see what we have here. Push to level off. Yeah, let's let's do that. Let's hope that works. Now you want to descend us now. Okay, plane, you better behave here. Right, it says thrust idle for some reason. I don't have any clue why the thrust would be idle because we're at eighty percent. But at least we're leveled now, which is which is great news. At least we're leveled. All right, um, enter destination data. It says UTC 726. What is the time right now here on this clock? Uh, this is what 555. Uh, that's that's a while. That's a while. I don't know how much the YouTube actually says we have the time. Let me check real quick. Oh wait, what? Well, we don't have the overlay. No way. Okay, give me one second. All 
Oh, we're back. We're back. We did not go anywhere. Uh, let me do that again. Uh, where did we? O L. What was it? Ah, where did we take off from? <laughs> that was O L B A, and then we're going to O R B I or B. Of that international, and we are K I A W 445. All right, that sound, that sound is annoying. A let me not say that that way. All right, level up, just stay there, just stay there, and don't make these, those annoying sounds. That's it. That's like a good one. We're gonna stay outside and enjoy the scenery out here. Oh boy. Real time. Real time. What do we say it? Um, real time troubleshooting. That's what it is. How to add a blooper to the livery. What livery? No, no way. No way of doing anything like that, buddy. At least, at least we are level now, which is good. Oh, or we might be reaching our top of descent here. Maybe not. So we're at 355. Let's go into the tablet here. All right, Fireball, I'll, I will definitely check it out after the stream. Don't worry about that. Well, I, I got you, man. I got you. I will definitely respond. All right, here we go. Sim brief. Uh, I don't think you can do that. Link MCDU. Uh, performance and our current altitude is gonna be 30 oh oh wait what three five five hundred and <laughs> that's it's changing the cameras oh boy sync wait what does that do and target altitude, so we're gonna check bump out real quick. I'm gonna check it right here. Hey, Mahanair, buddy! Welcome, welcome, welcome! Nice to see you, my friend. Rocking the A32NX. Which, as usual, doesn't behave. Oh, we're trying to make it behave. Anyway, the altitude at Bug Dot is just 113 feet, so we're gonna put that in here. And there we go. Just hit enter. So, descent about one, one, uh, one nautical mile below before the target. Or maybe if we do like a uh, 3,000 feet per minute, so 884. What? No, 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 no. Oh, okay, that's why. All right, 88. Yeah, that's that's a much better number. All right, so before 88 nautical miles from the destination, we're still 243 miles from there, so we still have some stuff. And some time to kill here. Monar says, hope all is well. Absolutely, man. I was just, I was just telling them about Thursday. They, you, and you, you better tell them too to wait for that very special announcement, man. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. I'm gonna quickly finish this off. I don't know you with my glass of smoothie. Oh, that is looking good. Smoothie down into the tummy. So, by the way, who's who's excited for the CRJ coming out? And here's a fun fact about CRJ: if you guys didn't know, it does not have auto throttle. You gotta have manual throttle the entire flight. Remember that. Otherwise, you'll buy it and you'll be like, "Oh, I wasted my money." <laughs> 
So, but but who's excited for it? I, I don't know if I'll get it. I'll, I'll have to see the reviews and see how good or not it is, and then I'll, I'll take the call to get it or not. But I don't know who who, who here is gonna do a first day buy. good finally stable at three uh, sorry 35,500 feet which is not the altitude you want to be at but that's that's the only choice you got friends that's the only thing you got not let it bring you down yeah so one thing I did notice about this is like the ortho is very blocky you can see you can see one tile which is right here and then this is the second tile or something something is oh now now it loads up I zoom out I don't know yeah but that's not something that I've seen a lot with Microsoft is that there are two distinctive tiles I don't know if other people have that problem but definitely something that I've been experiencing here's the wing view Alright guys, uh, give me two minutes and I'll be back in less than five. Actually, that is a bad way to say it. Give me a little and I'll uh, I'll get back in a second. Let me go ahead and get rid of that. And bring the BRB screen. There we go. I'll be back in less than five minutes before the countdown timer ends. We're back. We are back. Hello, hello, hello. We're back with the camera as well. <laughs> How do you become a mod? Um, yeah, uh, you know, just just be loyal. Um, you know, hang hang out with us on streams, on Discord, things like that. 
and then at the end of the day you know people who have obviously joined first they get the priority but and we we give out the mods in like a need to know ba uh, need to mod basis I would say so basically as as the channel grows and as we have more people and we'll, we'll consider getting more mods but currently we're good with the amount of mods we have but yeah the earlier you were a part of the channel the pre the higher the preference you get but don't worry you guys are still pretty early definitely not gonna lie uh, Sampa says I probably will not be the first day by it cause simply I don't even have yeah that is true that is true absolutely man <laughs> Erno, hey, welcome back, Erno. <laughs> oh crap, something broke. No, it was, it was just the smoothie glass I went to put back, and I dropped it. So, that's that's what the sound was. <laughs> this is hilarious, though. Absolutely. What what are these artifacts that I'm seeing? This is this is crazy. Do we have it on the other side? Yeah, we have it on the other side as well. All right, let's have a look. By the way, Cosmokid, welcome, welcome, welcome. Nice to see you, my friend. Welcome to the stream. We have a bunch of clouds here. Losing sight of the ground now. Huge, huge, huge. Oh, that's looking good. 35,000 stable. How much do we have? Enter destination data. It says we're still 175 miles out, so we're going to keep it. Uh... Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely, man. Work <laughs> out. Alright, yeah, go ahead, ask it. We never say no to asking questions. Waiting for your question, my friend. Sample says, although if it is offered for one day free, <laughs> that's that's probably not gonna happen, man. I don't I don't see Aerosoft doing that. It's a big brand, that is for sure. Um, oh, I did not know. Denver was bringing that out. I did not know that they, they gave it out for free, man. I, I would have definitely gotten that. Not gonna lie. Arno says, hey, Cosmo. Could you tell us your life snap for bro? I don't I don't want to bore you guys <laughs> with my life story, man. That's that's hilarious, man. Someday, someday, someday on a long haul, maybe. Yeah, I mean, it's just just an ordinary life, buddy. Ordinary life. <laughs> nothing, nothing too special. I'm, I'm not that famous yet. Home cockpit. Yeah, absolutely. So I'm just in the middle of checking some charts here for 15 left. And how big is the runway though? That is important to know. Oh, they're big, more than big enough. 15 left is 13,000 feet long, man. Oh boy. 13,000 feet, can you imagine? That's that's a too big of a runway for an airport located at 110 feet above the sea level. <laughs> Come on, man. Cosmo has a, a genius of a cockpit right there. Oh, couple days, man. Wow. That is absolutely interesting. So, Pop Kiwi Chrysler? Too bad. Not too bad. The iOS is looking good. Let's go inside the cockpit now, um, check, uh, yeah, 120 miles, we're gonna have to start our descend, uh, to 88 miles before we go at 3,000 feet per minute, so we're, we'll, we'll go like, uh, maybe 100, 110 miles from, from the destination, that's, that's what we're aiming for today. Um, well, let's go back on that, constraints are obviously on, everything is looking good, let's go ahead with auto brake low. We gotta, we gotta get a new METAR information. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Cosmo Kid. Where this Carabas tactics? Uh, uh, could have sworn I mentioned it in your Discord when that happened. Oh man, I might have missed it, man. I might have missed it. And you know, everything's like super crazy. So I might have definitely missed it. But here I am trying to do something for you guys. Alright, that, that's not looking bad. Oh, by the way, 18 likes coming up on 20. Really, really appreciate each one of you coming out and hanging out with us. 445 on the subscriber count. Can we get to 450 today? It's a mini milestone we gotta get before we can officially start our road to 500. 440 to 450 has like taken forever. Forever and ever. <laughs> This is crazy, crazy stuff going on here. Now it says I'll build A320 cockpit because I can use... And uh, don't forget A330, man. A330. Almost the same. Almost the same. A330. And I, th I think... I, I, don't, I don't know how the A220 cockpit looks like, but that could be one more plane you could fly as well. Right? That's, that's one good thing about Airbus is that they, they try to keep everything like very similar to each other. So that that is always good. Hey, look at that. They they are very way, you know. Most stuff you are, you will be able to use it, man. I have the A three thirty. Come on. Okay, two A two twenty. Okay, yeah, yeah. I I have no clue about the two twenty, but at least. At least you get the A3 318 to 21 and then obviously the Neos and the A330 to some extent. Um, so that that is definitely a stuff that you know you can do. You can probably you can probably use an iPad or something for the MCDU as well. That would be good. That would be pretty cool stuff to do. James Ba, hello from Maldives, man. You seem to be having fun there. <laughs> hello, welcome, 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 James. We are just cruising, almost getting there to our top of descent. Welcome to the stream. Pleasure to see you, my friend James. Hello, hello, hello. Hope you are having a great day so far, my friend. Such a pleasure to see you. Yeah, overhead is different, but at least the other stuff you can use are not right. I haven't even paid attention. No, I, I think the 737 Max is actually a lot like the 737 uh, normal, normal 737, and then it it actually um, the the screens and all those stuff that that is like similar to the 787, but otherwise it is very close to the 737. That that was the point of them saying it, you know. <laughs> Yeah, seven eight seven. Yeah, not not the uh, triple seven. <laughs> yeah, but but most of it most of it is the same as the normal seven three seven. So that was the selling point of uh, Boeing to actually sell those aircraft. Is that oh you 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 need minimum training you know to switch to these planes? It's almost the same. Just just a couple things here and there. You take some training and you're good to fly it. And that's 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 what caused the problems. But it is very similar to 7.3 and then, yeah, obviously the screens and everything is like the 7.8. Considering A350 though, I don't know where I can get components. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta have a big screen, probably an iPad or some, some sort of tablet there. Uh, doing good, first flight on the trip. Oh! Oi! I've, I, here's the thing, man. I've, I've been on a 787. I've been on the, what do you call it? Um, uh, on the A380. I got, I've been on the A320, but it's one plane or two planes. I'll say set, triple seven and seven four seven. Not being able to get onto those. That is always something that I'm looking forward to do. 
All right, 100 miles from, we're gonna go ahead and start descending all the way down to 10,000 feet here. There we go, and let's bring the open descent in. We're already descending, wow. A380, yep, I've been on the A380. In any sim, man, you, you you better get a P3D and fly that one right now, man. It's it's amazing. It's amazing. The triple seven on the PMDG triple seven is mind blowing, and I think they just released an update today or yesterday, I believe. This the, the, they they just completely. Yeah, wait, 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 hold on, hold on. Why why would he do that to me, bro? Bro, oh hello. Hello? Let's bring the speed brakes out here. It's clear. Stop. I have no clue why I would do something like that. Well, let's just descend at Mach 0.7 for that speed brakes. Oh, bro, bro. No, you can't, you can't speed up. <laughs> This thing is horribly wrong. Something is... Uh, let's do this. Let's do it this way. Yeah, this should be better. Yeah, let's go down 2700 feet per minute from here. That is looking good. Um, let's make sure the plane follows it. The only scarabus I've tried is... A300, but yeah, man, that, that plane is a charm to land. Not gonna lie, man. That plane lands like a champ. All right, let's get rid of this speed brakes now. Oh, uh, yeah, 300 ER, absolutely, absolutely. I like all planes except Embraers. <laughs> oh, God. And Embraers are good. They're, they're good for regional jets, not gonna lie. All those things are so amazingly huge. Yeah, both the 777, the A350, and the 787. And the best out of the lot is yet to come, the 777X. I'm, I'm waiting for that. I'm waiting for our friend Adrian to get that thing out in the market as soon as we can. And we'll have the best 777 out there on the market in X-Plane, definitely. Because PMDGs are not gonna go to X-Plane anyway. Having here, just not chatting. No worries, Gemini. We know the drill here. We're all good. All good. All good. Our right, 303. Let's do a 280 on the descent here, or maybe let's actually do 275 on the descent. We gotta slow this thing down. I don't want to get down too fast. Wait for the. Yep, the triple seven X man. That would be beast man the engines can you can you can you imagine can you imagine this engines the size of a plane like i i don't know who has heard it but the end the, the the radius of the engines the ge9x i believe those are the engines the radius of that is actually the the radius of the 737 fuselage like that is just beyond comprehension as to how that engine can be so big man this is just 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 crazy crazy stuff man can't 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 wait to and i'll add to that cosmo key can't wait to see it i'll say can't wait to hear it man on, on plane spotting live hear those huge engines man that's that's gonna be something else and maybe some reversers there as we speak with that <laughs> the only reason why i would fly an a320 is to say super <laughs> yep I, I I'm I'm gonna the A380 is gonna be the first day by you know, once once the any builds come out it's gonna be first day by that is for sure man I'm definitely getting that one or A220 has to go with the competition it's a good idea you can save fuel and fly longer yep absolutely oh wow wow you you're gonna be you're gonna be one lucky guy I'm the one lucky guy to be able to fly that plane man. Lo love to get some videos on that. Hey James, I don't know if you're if are you are you on on, on our Discord already? 
If not, man, I'd love to connect with you right there, man. Absolutely. You know, maybe maybe have some insights from you. <laughs> oh God. All right, eighteen thousand feet. We gotta bring up the weather here now. Um, Atsu. AOC menu weather request. Let's ask for it again. Send. And then we'll wait for the received messages. Uh, let's just reduce that here a little bit. 2,500 feet per minute. 100 percent sure for you. You fly for Qatar. <laughs> what? What? You had an emergency landing. What was what was the reason there? Yeah, James. Sure, sure thing, man. Looking forward to see you, buddy. <laughs> Absolutely, man. I did not know you were a real world pilot, man. It's it's now that I come to know, man. That would be so cool, man. You're one lucky person. I'm I'm pretty sure you worked super hard for for you to get there. But man, it's always always a good thing to have, man. Really, really awesome. Anyway, uh, let's get that receive text messages. Meetar. Let's print that out. Apparently, cockpit smoke. We landed in Zurich. Oh boy. That would be not so good. All right, one three zero at nine. Uh, altimeter one zero one zero. Let's let's do that here. One zero one zero. Make sure it is Q and H. We're coming down at ten thousand feet. Let's continue our descent down to eight thousand and bring that back up. Continue that descent. Um, let's make sure we have the stuff we need in the flight plan. ILS 15. 15 left, rather. Oh, let's go to the arrivals page. Yep, ILS 15 left. Radnav. We don't have that. Uh, well, let's bring in the Alice's here. And then on this side. Alright, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. And each one of you out there. We're coming down. Ten hours later, the plane came and we went to Doha. The terminal was amazing. Oh boy! Wait, wh what? You don't know? <laughs> Some questions are better left unanswered. I agree with that. I absolutely agree with that. All right, this looks good. Let's bring it to 40 now and continue that descent. Let's bring her down 30 and. Bring the speed down to 265 here. We're coming there. We're coming down. All right. So at Popki, I'm gonna look at the charts real quick. At Popki, we're supposed to be at 2,100. So if we can't make it there, we're just gonna go down and we'll. Uh, and actually, you know what is does it? Why does it not say Delmi? Because that's where we're going first. Uh, but recoil. Let's go direct recoil. Um, R E C O Y. It's not in the route for some reason, but we're gonna use that. And we'll see if our plane goes there. Oh god, <laughs> we messed something up. What? What on earth? Oh, why, why are we speeding up? No, bro. No. Let's give it some speed brakes here. Slow us down. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna reduce that descent right here. Yeah, this plane is not behaving at all. I'm coming under 10,000 feet. We're gonna go speed 245 knots here. Adam, welcome to the stream, my friend. Pleasure to see you. Hello, hello, hello. Hope you're doing well. Long time, buddy. Long time. Absolutely, man. Pleasure to see you, Adam. Fireball 8981. Yeah, go ahead with your question, man. You don't have to ask every time before asking a question. <laughs> How do you get more planes? Um, so there, on, on MFS, there's not many planes right now, but so you have to use the ones that are default. But as, as they come out more with the market, um, that's when you can get more planes. That's when you can get more planes. Recoil. T6. I have no clue what is happening here. Yeah, that's Delmi. We we don't need Delmi here, so let's clear that. 
No, hold on. Alright, where is the direct? Recoil. Okay, we're we're just we're just gonna do. It. I have no clue what's going on here, but let's enter the destination data here. Um, Q and H is one zero one zero. Temperature is seventeen one seven. Winds are one three zero at niner. That's the approach speed decision height. For this one is ILS is 410. Uh, DA is 410. This is altitude 410 here. MDA. There we go. All right, we're now we're still not below 250. Uh, let's reduce that further and let's bring in the zoom here. We might have to we might have to do on our own vectoring here. 7,000 let's continue that to 3,000 and please continue that descent for us All right, let's get rid of the music here. The music is driving me crazy Here we go um, Let's bring in the charts uh, not the charts. Oh replay mod. I forgot the replay mod I'm gonna bring in the camera real quick and then we can go into the replay mod all right, hold on. Control scam coming in. Three, two, one, go. And then obviously the replay mod. Uh, let me bring that up. I'm gonna need that. Now uh, there, packages. Flight recorder. There we go. Hopefully it's coming on. When is the next plane coming out? The next plane's coming out tomorrow, buddy. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Let's get this. Let's get this. I need an airline simulator. Create an airline and you slowly expand and expand. I know. I know. That that would be crazy. That would be crazy. Absolutely. Love to do... Wait, what? Wait, wait, which? Hello? Oh. Dude. Ah. I'm taking manual control here. All right, bro. Why? Why would you just climb out of nowhere? It's just, just ridiculous, man. Ridiculous. Let's keep that speed brake going. I'm gonna have to descend here. I'm hand flying this thing now. We do have the ILS right there. We're gonna descend at at Papke. We're supposed to be at 2,100. That will be when our glide slope will be active. The music is off now. Or just just trying to descend like a sane person here. Let's bring her to speed down 235. Let's go ahead. Landing lights on. Taxi lights to nose or the nose lights to take off. Sorry, <laughs> runway turn offs and wing lights can come on. There we go. Why is I have no clue, bro. You see, I, I haven't even touched anything. It just it just wouldn't behave, man. I have no clue whatsoever, man. No clue whatsoever. Uh, we're obviously, as you can see with the diamonds right here, we're higher than the glide slope, so we're going to continue descending here. Don't want to get that speed too high. Keep that in check. Um, 235, let's do a 225. Let's get us on idle thrust here obviously using speed brakes right now we're gonna do a left 360 here just crossing that waypoint and we'll bring her back it's always me it's always me I have no clue why <laughs> Go from CRJs to 747s. Yeah, man, that would be amazing. Now you, you could actually have like people fly for the UVA, man. That, that would be like icing on the cake. Right, we're still descending here. Trying to keep that speed 225. Let's actually bring it down to 215 now.
I don't know why we don't have the buildings come up yet, or maybe it's not. This is Baghdad, by the way. Iraq. That's where we're going. We're making that left turn, and then we'll try to get to that. Alright, All right, time for flaps one. Get us some drag going here. Maintain that speed. Obviously, only the slats come out in the air. Flaps come out when you're on the ground for the flap one setting. Alright guys, as you can see we're hand flying this boy. Thankfully the visibility is clear so there's so much we can do. Now let's get rid of that and then go ahead and set that up right here. Alright, now on the glide, so we're gonna reduce that descent right here. Just come in. Come in, come in. Yeah, just, just stay leveled here and then we can just keep following the glide from there. We are going to land in probably five minutes now. Probably five minutes. Oh, we go 220 on the speed. Let's bring her down to 185. Uh, what our final approach speed is going to be 131. There we go. <laughs> it's cloudy. <laughs> man, it's the same, man. Yep. That is, you guessed it right, my friend, Monair. You absolutely guessed it right. Tehran is the next one. I promised you on that one, and I'm doing it. I'm going to Tehran next. And the Mahanir livery, of course, man. Of course, how can I forget that? Uh, let's let's intercept here. Should be good. We're slightly below the glide slope, which is a good thing. Let's go flaps two. Those flaps are super quick, man. I, I still haven't gotten used to those. And we have the airport in sight, I believe. Just gonna go ahead and follow the glide slope down there. Localizer is alive. Yep, Delta soon, buddy. Delta soon. 165, let's go gear down. Flaps 3. Get your landing rate predictions in. The gear's coming down. Uh, real life, probably yes. Uh, it's difficult flying, but yeah, the, yeah, on the sim also, you know, the worst part is like you gotta be good with the landing. Oh no, Mama Shark's here. Oh no, just in time for the landing. <laughs> oh boy, <laughs> here we go. All right, ILS 15 left set. Set. Um, here we go. Just just a little bit low on the glide there. Uh, let's get to our final approach speed, which is again 131. We're doing this early because I don't trust this plane, and that's why I'm do I'm I'm, I'm just doing it early. Don't want to risk. And flaps full. Here we go. Fully configured. Lights are on. Looking solid. Auto brake is set. Spoilers on. Seat belts. No smoking. Landing lights are on. Let's just go ahead and check the cabin here, real quick. Cabin crew, please take your seats for landing. There we go. Saya Mahala, can you tell me why, when I move the yoke in the center position from moving it in real life? The Yoko joystick in the game won't wait, hold on man. I gotta I gotta read that again and I'm hand flying this. Can you tell me why when I move my yoke in the center position from moving it? The yoke in the joystick. Man, you know what? There there might be so if, if it does move on your joystick and if it does move inside, then it, it should center itself most most of the time. Otherwise, there might be some some issue with your joystick or something. You'll have to check your calibration and things like that. What 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 joystick are you using, Isaiah? Love to know that, man. 
I think this will be a little late landing, but I think it will butter. I hope so. I hope so we get that. Crazy peasy in the market. 131 on the speed. And we're still slightly low, but we have the runway in sight. I gotta bring up the replay mod. Uh, God. Record. Alright, the replay mod's recording now. It's MSFS. Most of the times it's easy to land. Sometimes it's hard to mess. Sometimes it is easy to mess things up. <laughs> Oh, what do we have here? There we go. Flaps will butter this. Let's let's get that greasy peasy going, man. We got one last time on MFS. Let's see if we can get it on this one. Ah, that's that's gonna be hard to beat a negative 13, man. It's it's hard to beat. <laughs> Not gonna lie, but who knows? Who knows? Are looking good. Why is the plane feeling like it's super slow or something? I have no clue. It's just like taking forever to reach the runway. Slightly low here. Satek Cy Cyborg. Hey man, just just check the calibration on that and make sure everything is working because if you if you if you're if I'm letting if I'm doing this and letting go of the stick, it should it should center itself. But if you're flying an Airbus, then you gotta you gotta bring it back to the center. Because that's that's how the fly by wire system works, Isaiah uh, man. Uh, but yeah, without without actually seeing what the problem is, I can't comment much on it. But I'll definitely be ha happy to help. Go ahead and join the Discord. The link is in the description. I about might put it as well. Uh, let me put it Discord, and you should get the link there. And we, there's there's a lot of people that can help you out right there, as well. All right, looking good. Five mile final here. Baghdad, here we come. Alright, make sure the speed brakes are armed, which they are great. It's looking good, looking good, looking good. No worries, man. Always, always, always happy to help, Isaiah. Alright, guys, final chance to get your landing rate predictions in. We have our center... What is that sound? What is that? Alright, it's gone. Alright, runway in sight. We have the wasis, not the poppies here, but the wasis are the wasis, how, how they call it. But we're looking pretty good. Don't want to say I'm stable or Chief is going to kill me if I get up that landing. Oh boy. There we go. Coming in. Frames are dying as usual as we come in for landing. Sometimes it's looking much better, but we'll have to see how it goes towards the uh, rear end of that. All right, moment of truth. Moment of truth, my friends. Speed is looking good, slightly low. Bring that nose up. Not on the center line, correcting for that. We have a straight headwind, which is good. ILS is saying we're low and the Wasis are saying we're high. I have no clue what to trust here. So I'm just gonna trust my eyes. Oh, these are some different kinds of lights. There we go, negative 237, reversers, speed brakes. <laughs> that thing slows down like a brick. <laughs> All right, 80 knots, reversers off. That that thing slows down so fast. <laughs> oh boy, well we did, we did well, I'll take that landing. Beautiful, 237. I'll take that. Obviously, we're going to go ahead and check out the replays. So don't go anywhere. We're going to definitely be going and checking out the replays. Absolutely, my friends. All right, let's, let's not let that auto brake work in and bring it down. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Baghdad. 
we are almost complete with the leg number 12 here obviously we have the landing replace coming in don't miss out on that one Erebus has spoilers I see yeah yeah I see we have Boeing on the mind absolutely <laughs> I mean, at the end of the day, it's like the same thing, right? <laughs> but I, I get, I get it. You gotta be technical with with all those stuff as well. All right, spoilers back, flaps going off. Let's go ahead, turn on the APU here, and wait for that start button. I'm gonna have to refer the charts as to where we're going here. Navigraph, taxi. All right, so basically we turn left and then that's where it's going to be. All right, uh, start the APU. Let's turn on APU bleed here. And once the APU is available, we can go ahead and do the single engine taxi. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, welcome to Baghdad. The local temperature here is, I have no clue. Wait, hold on. I'll tell you. <laughs> local temperature 17 degrees. The time is 741 welcome 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 obviously we're not flying real time <laughs> there we go I'm, I'm gonna take that landing any time of the week thank you thank you Erdal thank you all right now we're gonna turn left here obviously a little fast on the turn there we go on the left is the terminal where we're gonna go What's the next leg? We're going to Tehran, the home of our friend Mahaner. In the Mahaner livery, so that is gonna be a very, very special one. But before that on Thursday, we're gonna have a very, very special stream to a special destination and something else is also coming in. So be on the lookout, guys. If you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed the landing. And obviously don't forget to hit that like button. Really, really appreciate each and every one of your support right here, right now with you guys. This is absolutely gorgeous. Check out, obviously get rid of the lights here. Runway turnoffs can go off, taxi lights can go off, and before we crash into something, we gotta stop this thing right here. All right, we overshot, no worries. Let's set the parking brake here looking good um, i'm not gonna shut down the engines because we gotta jump into the replace um so obviously yeah you don't want to uh, destroy the quality of the replace just in case i haven't tested it but here we go ladies and gentlemen time for the music let's run the replay music all right Replay. There we go. Now we're we're gonna pause it. Go a little bit forward and resume replay. There we go. We're still way too far out, so we're gonna go a little bit further ahead. There we go. Here we have the replay mod kicking in for the second time on the channel. Beautiful guys. <laughs> Such a pleasure to see it. Look at that. Look at that. Like that's that's the view you want to see. But we'll, we'll get to win views in a second. First we'll watch from the outside. Obviously we did not get the perfect center line out there. But of course man this is this is something all you know super hard to control <laughs> but I'm, I'm i'm proud of that landing obviously we can always do better on center line and then touchdown luckily i think we did not float too much we'll find out where we were shortly here we go on the final very short final very stable <laughs> looking good says james yeah thank you thank you thank you man really really love oh what <laughs> look at that <laughs> look at that look at that that's that's not how it was so that there's obviously some bugs with the elevator thankfully it's flying correctly which is more important right now here we go retard what happened there just yeah could have flared a little bit more but i'll take that absolutely yeah the center line could have been much much better but let's go ahead 
go back and watch uh, resume replay watch from that window here see what you guys saw beautiful cloudy weather here rainy weather coming in that looks so good I see you took my settings and tuned them I am gonna ask to your settings there we go there's the touchdown right there that's the touchdown beautiful you see the wing flex let's go back on the other wing view and let's enjoy from there actually we we'll use that other view from for the other one let's let's use this one resume replay i love this view look at that water and everything saya says best landing i've seen thank you thank you we've obviously done better but i'm so glad you guys enjoyed that landing still have a couple of angles coming in before we say our goodbyes guys really 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 do appreciate the support if you haven't already make sure to hit that like button we're too short of 25 we can get there but let's let's watch this one from this angle and then we'll get into the i i wish we had tower views and things like that on mfs uh obviously the frames are dying so we're not gonna we'll, we'll pretend we didn't see that but there we go the flare look at that just holding the nose holding the nose and you know just just going from there you don't don't have to always aim for the for butter or a greasy PZ as we call it. But anyway, on to the final view of the replay today. Resume the... No, actually, this is the one we've already seen. This is the one I'm talking about. I don't know if we're seeing the... Uh, what's it called? The flaps are full? I think they don't look full, but they may be. I may be wrong here. But that's the last view coming in, my friends. Here comes the touchdown. Beautiful. Very close to the blocks, I have to say. Spoilers coming out. Not speed brakes. Spoilers coming out. <laughs> and that rollout. Insanely quick rollout ending there. But guys, that is pretty much it for tonight's stream. Thank you so, so much for everyone who stopped by on the channel. I hope you enjoyed the stream. Thank you so much for all the 23 likes we got here. And two new subscribers. Really, really really appreciate each and every one of you hanging out here with us but that is gonna be it for today's stream until then it's very special stream is actually coming in on thursday so don't miss out on that go ahead and join the discord if you guys haven't already and i will see you there definitely 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 guys this has been a pleasure until then bye bye take care stay safe everyone and sim aviator signing out see you later